Hello community! On the left side we have OpenAI 01 preview and on the right side we have the latest QWQ32B preview model from QN. So what do we do? We load up the test that I know. Both get the exact same, same test. This is my here, my extreme logic test. We have seven artifacts, seven fields of magic, seven familiars, and then we have a lot of cues. And the instruction is simple, just position everything in a matrix of seven times four. Submit, go, and now you see this here side by side. Now you see that with the QWQ, we see the system thinking. With O1, it is secret. They don't want that you watch what the system is doing, any clues that it is trying to have here a path of augmentation. So let's see which, fi which system finishes first. It is much more interesting to watch and see QWQ, really see because you can read, no? Okay, so it's done. There are different set of cues trying to find here the right combination of things, the right permutation here, trying out all the different possibilities. It's also kind of nice to see how the augmentation pattern evolves. I mean, I can't read it because I'm not that fast in reading and, and talking to you about this, but have a look yourself. This is real time. So you see O1 preview is still thinking, has no output, can focus totally here, just on thinking and QWQ gives us here the inside. Everything so the final assignment is. We have a final assignment by QWQ. Yes, and the winner in the speed test is QWQ. So what is happening to O1 preview? What's happening over there? It is thinking. It is still thinking. My goodness, how long does it take? Both were brand new started. We had nothing tested before. This is a brand new setting. And we are waiting for our O1 preview to come up. And I do this now because you remember, every week or every month, maybe OpenAI changes a little bit the model without telling me now in particular here that they changed the performance of the model. Finish thinking. As potentially violating Please try again with a different prompt. You gonna be joking, eh? Try again. Come on. I mean, there's nothing you can be afraid of. This is pure nonsense. So you know what we're gonna do now? I say provide a detailed explanation of your reasoning process. Okay. I said, just say, hey, this is it. Present your answer in a final answer in a clear way. Okay, if you want it, here you have it. There's no instruction. Ah, yeah, look. Clarifying accuracy. Okay, assessing the outcome. Okay, I will let it run in real time so that we can see exactly the timing. Because if you ask to provide a reasoning, you're uh, violating here the policy of OpenAI. My goodness, grow up, OpenAI. Competitors are almost there. So, gathering the artifacts, yes, beautiful. Courting here the possibilities. Connecting the clues, piecing together the clues. Assembling the cues, coming to a final conclusion. Mapping out the options, mapping wizard characteristic, my goodness, pairing the keys, you should have done this by now. Mapping out the wizard, yes, organizing the detail, presenting 55 seconds, thank you. Okay, so I was not allowed to ask for the reasoning process. Okay, so here's the final answer now. So we have it now here, the answer here by O1 preview. Oh gee, I got a, I got a. Something. Oh, I got a dot. And here we have QWQ here, if you want to see this here. We are live and we have it here. So let's have a look. Avalon. Crystal of Time, Phoenix, Enchantment. Crystal of Time, Enchantment, Phoenix. Beautiful. Brindor. Amulet of Dreams, Salamander. 
Divine Nation, Amulet of Dreams, Divine Nation, Salamander, Jack. Celestia, Illusion, Tome of Secrets, Chimera. Tome of Secret, Illusion, Chimera. Dorn, Necromacy, Mirror of Truth, Unicorn, Mirror of Truth, Necromacy, Unicorn. Eldoria, Elemental Magic, Orb of Shadows, Pegasus. Eldoria, Orb of Shadows, Healing Griffin. Oh, 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 there we go, there we go, we have a first difference. Feeland, Ring of Realms, Elemental Magic, Pegasus. Feeland, Healing, Ring of Realms. Griffin, this is fascinating. This is now fascinating. So Griffin and Pegasus are exchanged. Griffin and Pegasus. Then Ring of Realms, Feeland is okay. And then we have here Elemental Magic. And here we have Feeland, Ring of Realms. No, uh, yeah, elemental healing. Healing and elemental magic. Here we go with the magic. So they are now exchanged. Look, Eldoria has here healing, and here Eldoria has elemental magic. So we have an exchange of elemental magic versus healing, and of Pegasus versus Griffin. Galoria, Staff of Elements, Alchemy Dragon, Galoria, Alchemy, Staff of Element Dragon. Beautiful. So we have one significant difference. We go step by step. So the wizard from Celestia studies illusion magic and does not have the Amulet of Dreams. Celestia studies here illusion, yeah, Jack, does not have the Amulet of Dreams. Correct. Eldoria holds the Orb of Shadows. Eldoria holds the Orb of Shadows, yeah. And is not versed in necromancy or alchemy. Yep, because we have elemental magic or healing. The wizard who owns the Crystal of Time has a phoenix. Crystal of Times is from Avalon and holds a phoenix and is not from Dorne nor Galoria. The enchantment wizard is from Avalon. Enchantment, Avalon, yeah. And does not possess Staff of Elements. Yep, correct. The wizard with the griffin familiar studies healing magic. The wizard with the griffin familiar studies healing magic. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Wow. Looks like QWQ got it right. Let's go on. No, let's just go here. The wizard, the wizard with the griffin familiar studies healing magic. The wizard with the healing. The wizard with the griffin familiar studies healing. Griffin familiar studies healing. Eldoria. Okay, griffin and healing. It's still okay. Griffin and healing, it's still okay. Phelant Wizards has the Ring of Realms. Now we go. Phelant has the Ring of Realms. Yeah, Phelant Wizard has the Ring of Realms. Phelant Wizard has the Ring of Realms. Yeah. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> but does not have a Salamander familiar. Phelant has a Griffin familiar. The Necromancy Wizard holds the Mirror of Truth and is not from Brindor. Necromancy Mount holds the Mirror of Truth and is not from Brindor. Yeah. The Wizard from Dorne has a Unicorn familiar, yeah, and does not study Divination. Correct. The Alchemy Wizard is from Galoria. Alchemy Wizard is from Galoria, does not possess the Tome of Secrets, yeah, the Staff of Elements. The Wizard who studies Divination has a Salamander. Divine Nation has a salamander, yeah. The Staff of Element is held by the wizard whose familiar is a dragon. Staff of Elements, where are we? Staff of Elements. Yeah, Staff of Elements is held who is familiar with a dragon. Yes, correct. The wizard from Brinder does not study healing. Brinder does not study healing, yep. The wizard with the Pegasus familiar studies elemental magic. The wizard with the Pegasus familiar studies elemental magic, yeah. 
The wizard with the Pegasus familiar studies elemental magic. Yeah. Nice the question. What is it? The Tome of Sequent is not held by the wizard from Avalon. The Tome of Secrets. Secunda. Tome of Secrets is not by Avalon. Yep. The wizard who owns the Amulet of Dreams is from Brindor. Yeah. You know what? You know what? These are both two correct solutions. And I just say verify that this is a correct solution. Verifying final assignments, assessing the alignments. Yes, come on, validating the solutions. Yes, mapping out wizardly domains. Both have it right. Is this possible? Is this possible? Reconstructing the solution, narrowing down the options. Yes, 55 seconds, come on. Mapping out the wizard connections, laying out the clues. Signing the artifacts. Identifying the locations. And now you have done it, pulling together the clues. Come on, old one, you just have to run through a complete set of instructions. You have to just to verify it. Validating the details, piecing together the clues. Piecing together the paths, locating the stuff. <laughs> Confirming the solution. S one minute, seven seconds. Well, I can give it correct. You proposed solution. Yes, I know this. Check, check, check. Check, 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 check. Check, 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 check. Your solution satisfies all the given clues perfectly. Each assignment assi aligns with the constraint provided and there's no contradiction. Your solution is correct. And I'll validate your own solution, which is different from the given solution by my last prompt. One minute and one second. My goodness. So, check, 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 check. All clues are satisfied in my proposed solution. The assignment assigns perfectly with taking constraint. There's no contradiction. I noticed that the primary difference between my solution and the one you provided lies in the elements of Eldoria and Feland. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Me too. I noticed this. Your solution, yeah, we, you see here, the Orb of Shadows is in both cases assigned to Eldoria and the Ring of Realms is in both cases assigned to the correct person. But we have here permutation of elemental magic and healing and a permutation of Pegasus and Griffin. Both solutions satisfy all the given clues. This suggests that based on information, there are two possible valid solutions to the puzzle. does not explicitly assign the fields of magic of uh, beyond certain constraints. Yeah, I know this. Because the clues do not provide further specificity about the realms associated with the Griffin Pegasus familiar, both assignments are possible without contradicting any clues. <coughs> Conclusion by OpenAI. My solution, valid. Your solution, also valid. Thank you, OpenAI. This is real nice. Two acceptable solutions to the puzzle. And logically consistent with the given clues. Both solutions remain valid. What a powerful model. QWQ32B preview, an experimental research model developed by the QN team, focuses on advanced AI reasoning capabilities. It got it right on the first time, the first try, it got it absolutely right. It found that there's another solution than the solution that ChatGPT01 preview found, which is absolutely fine. And this means that we have now an X equal. ChatGPT01 preview has been now beaten, if you want, X equal here with this brand new model. So it is not anymore alone. It has to share your position one with 
QWQ32B. What a powerful reasoning model developed by the q team. You can try it out for free on Spaces and I think it will become hopefully available and amazing. Do you know what? Also, it looks like you can do some mathematics and maybe in one of my next videos, we're going to have a look at mathematical puzzles and riddles. And let's see if then we will find the difference between O1 Preview and QWQ32B. But please note, this was just one test of one model on one platform. So this is not a statistical relevant result because I only tested it on one extreme logic test and normally you would run it, I don't know, 20, 50, 100 times and then you get an understanding about the performance. But I think in about one to two weeks, we will have both system here available on different open benchmarks so that the AI community can vote on the performance. And I guess in about one, maybe two weeks, we will have here a relative solid result if the performance of QWQ really reaches up to the performance of OpenAI latest O1 preview. I hope you enjoyed this as much as I enjoyed this test. We have now two number ones for the best reasoning AI system on our globe.